Above all, ours is a collaborative industry and our partner awards celebrate that. The Museum Volunteer Award, in partnership with the Canadian Federation of Friends of Museums, recognizes individuals or groups who generously volunteer their time and commitment to a museum or related heritage institution and have made a significant impact within our community. This year's winners are the volunteers of the Canadian Railroad Historical Association at Expo Rail, the Canadian Railway Museum in Saint-Constant, Quebec. The Canadian Federation of Friends of Museums marvels at how its 140 volunteers are essential to every sphere of Expo Rail's operations. They've helped to make it the foremost railway museum in Canada and among the most important in the world. Congratulations, CHRA volunteers. The Award of Excellence in Philanthropy honors donors who have proposed and funded ideas that have shifted the way communities benefit from the rich resources these institutions hold in trust for them. It's a great pleasure to announce this year's winners. Erwin and Frida Browns for their contributions to the Montreal Museum of Fine Arts and many more museums across Canada. For more than 50 years, these philanthropic leaders have donated to and funded collections and worked to increase public access to those collections through education and outreach. Recently, they've donated prints from their own collection to the Art for Healing program to help improve the mental well-being of others. Congratulations, Frida and Erwin. ICOM Canada's International Achievement Award honors a museum professional who demonstrates and promotes excellence in the field internationally. And this year's winner has applied her expertise towards the advancement of museology worldwide. The winner is Nathalie Bondil for her international contributions as Executive Director and Chief Curator at the Musée des Beaux-Arts de Montréal for what ICOM Canada cites as her unique contribution to museums and their important work, extending her leadership and vision from local impact to international museological practice. Our industry continues to evolve, and central to that progression is the emerging generation of young museum professionals. The Dr. Shirley L. Thompson Young Curators Award funds enhanced learning experiences for young graduates in art museums and galleries, in turn preparing them for curatorial careers. This year's winner will provide meaningful opportunities for an emerging curator who identifies as black, indigenous or a person of color to work on significant exhibitions at three university galleries across Halifax. The award goes to Halifax's Young Curator, a BIPOC curatorial internship at the MSVU Art Gallery at Mount St. Vincent University with support from Dalhousie Art Gallery and St. Mary's University Art Gallery. By pooling their resources, the galleries greatly expanded the Young Curator's opportunities and demonstrated a model that can be used by small galleries across the country. Finally, the Barbara A. Tyler Award in Museum Leadership. To quote its namesake, this biennial award celebrates the best leadership in museum management in Canada. And the winner is Dean Brinton, Vice Chair of the Board of Trustees of the Canadian Museum of History and the Canadian War Museum, honoured for the positive and lasting impact he's had and continues to have on Canada's museum sector, including his leadership in establishing the rooms in Newfoundland and Labrador. <laughs>